Anyways, so, um, hi, um, probably say this in every video that I make, but, um, I'm sorry about my hair. It's very, um, well, my bangs are kind of just, like, they, like, go like that. They, like, they're, like, side, side bangs and so, side slaps and go like that. But they go, like, they turn this way and it's just... <sighs> okay, anyway, so, yeah, I'm going to be making an update video. And, yeah, <coughs> I want to make a topic video soon because I've seen some comments, um, kind of about things like how my relationship is with my mom because of our eating disorders. You let me just right there. Is that weird? Can you guys, like, see, like, the camera? Can you? I don't know. Can we see, like, yeah, you can. I bet you can. Anyway, so, um. Basically, I haven't been up to date on my calorie counting, recording my weigh-ins, recording how much I'm binging and purging, um, which I would consider a good thing because it means I'm not as basically obsessive about it and I don't worry about it as much, I'd say. Um, I still have that conscious thinking not to eat too much. But I'm not writing down what I eat anymore. <clears throat> it might begin again, like I was thinking. Well, why not just write down what I've kept down to, or what I think I've, it's got, it has stayed down. <sighs> but I'm like, why should I do that? It's just going to make me worry about what I eat tonight, and I really shouldn't do that. Because, like, if you had, like, 50 calories for the whole entire day, you woke up at 6 a.m., and it's like 1 in the morning, oh, <coughs> no, <coughs> it's like 9 at night, and you recorded that you only have 50 calories, you're not going to want to have a peanut butter jelly sandwich because you're going to be like, I ruined that little number, even though that number is still going to be very um, small, but um, you're just not going to feel as like it's, you feel like you fail that, um, controlling how much you ate and that's not a good feeling and you shouldn't be worried about that so I just am trying to avoid food journals and journaling how much I weigh um but I have been dropping weight very quickly um I kind of like it uh I didn't really intend to lose weight but I'm at my lowest right now Oh no. I don't even know where to oh. Ask for reflux. I'm not gonna do that during the video. Some people might get sick or triggered by that. <coughs> um, my friend Dustin. So I'm not gonna make a video and then it's like alright. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Throat has a lot of mucus in it. Um, so yeah, I've been dropping a lot of weight. I haven't really intended to, it just kind of happened. Um Sorry, I, you just saw my cuts, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I just... Oh, it's just my brother. Okay, we're good. <laughs> yeah, I'm not really trying to. It's just gonna happen with all the binging and purging. And the, the basics, the um, number one cause for it is actually the acid reflux. Because, um, like, I'm trying to eat, but my body just doesn't really isn't used to it, it can't exactly handle it at the moment, so it gets rid of it because it's used to getting rid of it, um, which is really bad, um, yeah, and basically that's why I've been losing so much weight, um, went on a long walk today with my friend, and I did a hundred squats today, um, that's it, I didn't do anything else. I think I binged and purged three times today. Mm, it could have been two, but I ended up doing it before Logan came over. Um, Logan is the guy that I had that, like, Robert and Logan and I did something. And he came over today, and we just watched some YouTube videos and cuddled, cuddled for a while. It's over around town for, like, five or two minutes and then came back and then tried to watch TV but couldn't find the remote. Played with my dog and cat. Nothing. We didn't do anything like that. Um, so yeah, I really hope that we become 
like a couple soon. Um, so yeah, um, I really miss Kara. She's she's in Washington right now with her mom, um, because her dad lives where I live, and yeah, um, I think I've been doing pretty well. Um, after this incident, I think I've been doing well. Um, so, I'm trying to be a vegan again. It's not really for eating disorder. Um, it's not really an eating disorder thing for me. It's more of animal abuse. Because I know that you there's no, like, in plants, there's no B12 which is needed in your diet in order to maintain your bone density. But, um, the only reason that it's not in it, basically, cows have, they eat microorganisms when they consume grass because it's not washed. And those microorganisms are on all plants. And so basically, just don't scrub your veggies as clean. You're going to be consuming the B12 that you need. And your body will get used to that, and it will tolerate the bacteria, and just like cows do, because they've been eating that way for their whole life, you know. So, pretty much, yeah. Um, I know they don't all consume grass. Like, some of them consume feed and all that, and they still consume grass, and da 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 you know. I'm just saying that you can get B12 in your diet on a vegan diet. And Reagan May, she's not a vegan anymore. I don't really... Okay, I'm going to make a new video about this. Next video. Bye. <laughs> um, yeah, message me. Um, I'm sorry if I've been really, like, sounding irritated in my comments. This kind of makes me mad if some people are saying, like, um, you were never diagnosed. I'm confused. And just, like, I don't know, like, t asking for tips and stuff. Like, I'm not going to give you tips for an eating disorder because that's not what I do. I'm not going to help you just store yourself. So, destroy. Um, I'm gonna go make another video, so bye.